Franco will spend five more days at the Gigiri police station. A court has postponed its ruling on whether to release the former county boss or detain him for 30 days as requested by the Directorate of Criminal Investigations to Tuesday next week. And as John Miner now reports, uh, Kiambu court had earlier today also postponed its ruling on a different case facing Sonko. The former Nairobi governor Mike Mbuvi Sonko has not had it easy since the beginning of this week. Sonko was today presented at Kahawa West Law Courts, facing charges linking him to financing terrorism activities. The former county boss was brought to court under tight security. Kahawa West Chief Magistrate Diana Kavetsa adjourned the hearing to 9th February at 2 p.m. in a bid to give the defense lawyers ample time to be able to defend themselves. He shall be escorted to this court at 2 p.m. after Honorable Atambo's ruling at Kiambu Law Courts. Those are the orders of the court. Sonko will therefore have to spend five more nights in police custody. Earlier Thursday morning, the Kiambu magistrate postponed another ruling in which Sonko is facing among other assault charges. The Kiambu magistrate said she was not ready and has not had enough time to compile the ruling. The terror-related charges case file was opened on Wednesday evening after he was taken to Kahawa West Law Courts immediately after coming from the anti-corruption court in Nairobi facing graft charges. The hearing on terror charges will also take place on the same day later in the afternoon. Sonko is now being held at Gigiri Police Station awaiting to be arraigned at Kiambu Law Courts for his bail ruling on Tuesday. Joan Miner. TV 47.